Hi guys, and yeah, welcome to the channel. Andy here. Um, I thought today we actually we'll stay in St. Nits and uh, we're going to have a look at uh, some of the calves here. So we're going to try some of the calves here in St. Nits and see if we can find, you know, a nice one. Nice price, nice food. So the first calf that we're going to visit is actually down Moore's Walk. So we're going to give that a go. As I said earlier, our first stop actually is Moore's Court. Okay, so this is, uh, it's called Moore's Walk Calf. And uh, I brought a cup of tea and a, uh, a breakfast. And it comes to £5.90. And actually, it looks, it looks, actually it looks very nice. Well, that was very filling. I actually enjoyed that a lot. And it's a nice cup of tea as well. Cheers. Um, so that, that is uh, Moore's Walk calf here in St. Nets, and um, what we're going to go to now, um, we're going to go to another one which is the same sort of like a greasy spoon, which is um, the market calf. So we're going to head down to there next, and of course, that's on the market square here in St. Nets. So let's have a look at that. Oh, let me finish my tea first. While we're walking down to the uh, the market calf, um, if you haven't been to my channel before, um, thanks very much for visiting. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel, please do that as well, because that will be absolutely fantastic. And if you want to leave a comment, that'd be great. Anyway, let's head towards Market Square, which is of course where the market calf is. Well, that was the market calf there, and uh, I don't know, I think it's changed hands because the, the menu seems to be different. Before, it's a bit of a more of a sort of a greasy spoon sort of um, uh, calf, but this time uh, they do like burgers. And what I had there was uh, chips and a mushroom burger and a cup of tea, and that cost me. Um, I think it was about eight pound twenty, so a little bit more money than the uh, Moore's calf, but um, it, it was still very nice. Anyway, I'm going to head down the high street now and uh, see what else, what other calves are around. Now I mustn't walk underneath the ladder because it's actually bad luck. Our next calf is a griddle and no griddle and grind. So let's have a look at that. Well, I was going to call it a griddle and grind, but uh, it's actually closed. Anyway, let's move on, find a, another place. So the next place I think we go to is Costa's Coffee. Now we all know Costa's Coffee, so I don't normally go there because they're very expensive. But we thought we'd go and have a look anyway. Actually, decide to have his, his uh, Costa here. It's a cappuccino and a, a millionaire cake, and that cost me five pound and ten p altogether. Um, quite expensive, to be honest, actually, because this this cake here by itself that cost me cost me two pounds. Yes, it hurt. And of course, the cappuccino is a big one, so we're going to try that out and see see what that tastes like. Well, the cappuccino is quite nice, and try this two-pound cake. Not bad. Not bad. If you just come to the channel, big high, as Andy here, I'm not going to do around some of the calves 
here in Sydney it's to see you know the price and what the, what the venue's like so to speak so um, at the moment we're at um, Costa Coffee first time I've been here and uh, well quite a nice ambience here actually that's quite filling I'm quite full up now really two breakfasts and now this anyway let's see what else there's in Sydney it's With all this tea and coffee and breakfasts I've been having, I'm getting a bit full actually. I feel like I need a good run. Okay, let's have a look and see what else we can see. The Art and Soul Kath and Gary Creative Club. Let's have a look at that. Upstairs, that's where I'm sitting at the moment. Um, I've had a, I've brought a tea, it's quite expensive actually, it's £2.50. Uh, but I suppose the reason for that is that you, um, you've you got um, the art gallery upstairs which you can have a look around, and I'm going to show you a bit of that as well while I'm here. Nice I thought the, the tea was a bit expensive here actually, but you, you do actually get a, a mug as well, a mug, a teapot as well, should I say. So, um, and you get two or three cups out of it, so it's not that bad really. Let's have a look around the, um, the art gallery. Well, that was the, the Art and Soul uh, Caf and also Gallery, which, is, uh, which was a, a, a little bit different. Well, this is sitting here, it's the latest lounge, it's called the Ferro Lounge. Let's have a look. So here we are, the Ferro Lounge. This is actually the, one of the newest um, uh, bar restaurants actually in Sydney at the moment. Um, I just brought myself a Coke, because um, I'm getting a bit too much tea and coffee at the moment. Um, and the Coke cost me £1.70, gives you an idea. And they do food here as well actually, and I'm going to show you the menu. So I'm going to show you the, the prices actually um, for, for, for the lounge breakfast here it's about six pound fifty and mains uh, range from like ten pound fifty onwards actually so it's quite reasonably priced here I wouldn't say it's all that expensive the decor here is is, is actually quite nice and, um, and before this used to be a clothes shop I think it was like a Miss Selvages if I remember right uh, and uh, this is taken well, this has been opened up now for about uh, two, three months. Well, that was the Ferro Lounge. Okay, we're going to go, we're actually very near the Market Square once again. We're going to cross the Market Square and we're going to head towards uh, sort of tea gardens now. So the next cafe is Betty Bundle's Vintage Tomb Rooms. Let's have a look at that. So here we are, this is Betty Bumble's Tea Rooms and uh, it's got a sort of very sort of vintage tea rooms look as well as you can see.
So it's very quaint with the uh, with the teapot and everything. The price of the tea is uh, two twenty five, which is I suppose same price as that other place really. Cheers. Oops. Well, that was Betty Bumble's Tea Rooms. I said, a cup of tea there was 2.25. Service is very good, big smile and everything. The ambience is very nice, sort of very English, if you know what I mean, with the furniture and everything. And also a bit of um, background music from the sort of from the, from the 40s and 50s. Very nice indeed. Okay, so there we go, guys. That's my look at some of the bars, well, not bars, should I say, the cafes and, uh, um, and, and little restaurants here in St. Nears. I mean, there's a lot more, but we're, we're running out of time. It's a Sunday and everything closes at four o'clock anyway. So I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks very much for watching. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please do, we're absolutely fantastic. If you want to leave a comment, do that as well. Please share and, and, and press the like button as well okay so once again this is Andy saying thanks very much for watching and we'll catch you a little bit later I'll say bye for now bye bye